Hello Rocket League fans, now if you didn't know, the Dilbobs channel hit 80,000 subscribers not too long ago, and I made an oath that every 10,000 subscribers I get on the channel forever, I will give away one White Octane. So we gave away two White Octanes at 60,000 and 70,000 subs, now we're at 80,000, it's time for the next White Octane giveaway. So I need you to comment down below on this video what console you're on and what's your username. Now I'll do the full announcement of who wins the White Octane as a full video by itself, so you won't miss it as long as you're subscribed and turn on notifications. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoy this video, I'll see you on the next one, and let's get to 100,000 subs, because we got more White Octanes to give away. If you want an easy way to buy cheaper Rocket League items no matter what console you're on, head over to RL Exchange and use code DILWOBS at checkout for 3% off. It's a super easy site to use and there's a bunch of different payment methods that you can also use. And my favorite part is that they constantly run giveaways that you can enter by doing different tasks on the site. So make sure if you're buying things from RL Exchange, you also check out the giveaways tab because I know you guys love your free items. So why not do that? There's a link in the description that will get you all set up and hopefully you can enjoy buying some nice Rocket League items. Yo, what's going on guys? DILWOBS here and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel now honestly i felt like opening some crates again on rlsimulator.com honestly on this site there's a bunch you can do um but crate opening opening old crates is very fun to do on the site and they're actually updating it in like estimated around two months that can't be certain but they're bringing out credits and things like that it's gonna get super super updated we'll talk about that more later but for now I felt like opening crates, I'm going to bring you along for the ride, and if you saw on the right there, I might have to replay it in their edit, but somebody pulled painted dueling dragons from a crate. Now, that was perfectly timed because I actually got a tweet from someone recently saying the RL Sim Choice 4 crate, you can get painted dueling dragons in it, which is awesome, so maybe in this video we'll get it, maybe that'll be for another video. But as you can see, we're going to open crates. And obviously from the title of this video, unless we get something insane like Painted Jewel and Dragons, the title of this video is going to be, We Open Crates Until We Get a Black Market. So preferably, you know, we get a black market after about 8 minutes. That'll always be good. No, but seriously, whenever we get a black market, the video ends. Now, I've seen a lot of videos a bit like this before on YouTube when it's like, if I get this, if I do this, the video ends. And I really wanted to do those for a while. Look at that, Mandala Infinite Wheels. They are black market. In the last video, I saw them and I was like, I swear I just saw black market wheels. And on this, they're black market for some reason. Now, obviously, it's a little bit outdated. We almost got mainframe there. Jeez. Yeah, the site is, you know, it's not been super updated recently, but we have actually managed to get plenty of users online. There's currently around 70 online. I've seen like 150 online at once. Um, so it's a big step up. You guys have started playing it a lot, which, you know, I rate that. So I'm I'm down to, you know, play it more. But obviously when they update the site, um, the accounts will be like sort of reset and stuff. So we can all sort of start from fresh. I think it'll be a super fun little crate opening simulator we can all get involved in. But let's see if we can pull ourselves a black market anytime soon. Now, last time I did the video, I also edited in the Rocket League crate scrolling sound um, because there's no sounds on the site at the moment. Now, I have put forward the idea to them, so hopefully they update that, you know, next time. But for now, oh damn, it jumped up to 130 users, as you can see, that's cool. But for now, um, if I do want to have sounds of the scrolling, I'd have to edit it in. And honestly, guys, if you edited videos, maybe a lot of you do, you'd understand how long of a process it is just repeating that sound so it matches perfectly with the video. Um, so if I do it, then you have it. If not, I'm really sorry. At the time of editing, honestly, it was just a massive pain in the neck to do. Um, but maybe I'll add it for some of them. I don't know. Um, maybe, you know what? How about I just do the voice myself? How about I... Okay, goodbye, guys. Bye. 